Hey everyone, this is Aisha and welcome back to my channel. I'm here today to do a review. Well, I guess it's a review and also a brow demo. I'm here to review the new Fenty um, Brow NBP. It is a sculpting brow wax and pencil styler. I'm going to be doing a review on two of the lip balms. I got... Pinch Me and Coco Drizzle. I felt like these were the most brown girl friendly of the um, three that came out. And also they have a clear one because of course it's a bomb. But I did look up a few videos with the um, Fenty Brow Wax. But I felt like the people who use them didn't have hair like mine. So I was like, let me go ahead and do a little review. And I actually use Anastasia's Brow Gel when I do my brows. For the most part, this is what I use because I do like to have that lifted brow look. My brows, as you can see, do lay completely flat. So I'm excited to see what this actually does and if it gives like that laminated type of um, brow look. So if you want to see how this turns out, be sure to stay tuned. And also, if you haven't subscribed, like, what are you waiting for? Okay, so I brought you guys in a little closer so you can really see my brows. Like I said, my brows are not super thick, but I have a brow. Um, haven't really got my brows done in maybe a year. So um, I'm trying to just let them do their own thing. We're going to start with the brow wisdom. Let me show you guys what it looks like first. Here's the product itself. It has... A little brush on this side and then the gel I'm sorry the wax is on this side so this is the product here it says it's universal so it is clear so this is the product here you put it on your hand you can't really see it at all it's like I said it's for your brow wax so um, Fenty does these little brushes here. This is um, like a plastic little brush bristle situation. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to first I'm going to brush my hairs up and then I'm going to add the wax. Let's see if that works. I don't have any product right now on my brows. So let's see how this Goals. Okay, so the product's on, let's see. Now the premise of the product is to have more of a natural brow look because I see that trend is kind of getting away from having a very filled in brow that Instagram Atlanta brow that everybody has oh okay well compared to wow I actually like that compared to what my brow normally looks like that is a difference I'm still gonna fill it in just a little bit because I just feel like I need to but that is a big difference I think I am liking this so far. And I do feel like it stays in place a little bit better than the Anastasia gel because it's a gel and I kind of keep having to brush through it and brush through it with the spoolie to get the look that I want. Alright, so let's do the left. Again, I'm going to brush it up. My brows are so different. Hmm. Okay. Well, I do like it and I definitely see a difference. Okay. 
Okay. So I am impressed with it. I do like it. It feels pretty good. Um, I actually like the feeling better than the brow gel because the brow gel is a little uh, wet and it does make my brows a little crunchy. So, but um, yeah, I like it. So I'm going to use my favorite brow pencil, which is by Benefit. It is the Precisely My Brow Pencil. And I use right now, I'm using number four. I kind of go between different um, colors with it, but since my hair is a little bit lighter right now, I'm going to use number four. Okay. All right, Fenty, I see you. All right, so let's do this one. Okay, so my brow is filled in. I like it. Now I am going to go ahead and clean up the brow using my NARS uh, Natural Radiant Concealer in Amande. And then also I'm going to use for my brush, I'm going to use the Morphe. M165 brush. It's a little angled brush. So I'm going to just kind of clean up. I don't clean up under my brow. I'm sorry. I don't clean up on the top of my brow. I just really clean up on the bottom. I don't like my brow to look too drawn on, I guess you could say. Alright, so once I do that, I'm going to go in with my Morphe M505 brush. So it's a fluffy brush just to blend out. Alright, so I'm very pleased with the look of my brows, even um, in the mirror it looks really good. I do like this look. So I'm going to finish the rest of my face and then I'm going to come back and I'm going to swatch these for you. Be right back. Okay, so the rest of my face is done moved you guys back a little bit more i do like the brows um they have not moved they are in a place and i like it so i'm going to use this because you guys know i'm not big on um lashes but this is the new pat mcgrath um dark star mascara it's supposed to be like super dark y'all look how come on now this, it looks 
Like you don't even want to use it. That's just how nice it is. And her mascara is all the bomb if you have not tried them as of yet. So mascara is on the other eye. I figured I wouldn't bore you with that. You know how to put mascara on. Alright, so let's get into these lip balms. These tinted, I guess they're, you can say they're tinted lip balms, the Pro Kisses. So this is Pinch Me. Has like a pinkish look to it. So I'm going to just swatch both of them so you can see what the colors look like. This is Pinch Me. And then Coco Drizzle. Coco Drizzle is a lot more chocolatey. It's, can't really, well you can see them. You can see them pretty good. Alright, so I'm going to try Pinch Me first. I'm going to use both of them without pencils just so you can see what they um, really look like. Of course, like everything else Fenty, it smells very good. Alright, so this one... Okay, so this is the Pinch Me. You can wear liners with it because it is, you know, tinted. It's kind of like, um, even though it's a lip balm, it does, um, to me, have a little gloss appeal to it. All right. And now I'm going to go ahead and try on Coco Drizzle. Coco Drizzle to me is for people who want to really look like they have nothing on. At least for brown girls who want to look like they have nothing on. This is a very nice look, but it still moisturizes. It's not dry. It's not gloss. Because um, gloss, even though it has a shine to it, it still does not add moisture to your lips. These add moisture to your lips. Yes. So... I like this one as well. So, final thoughts. I definitely like the brow is. I still am getting a little used to that um, brush. How Fenty does their brushes because it's like a legit brush. It's not like a spoolie. But it did work well for this. I didn't feel like it worked well with the brow um, pencils that they have. I have. I purchased two of them. But I haven't really used them because of that. <clears throat> type of um, you know brush that they have the end that looks like this um, what's really going to be the test is how it holds up outside when it's hot so that's really going to be the test to see you know what it does because I am oily and that's what I'm thinking about um, definitely love the lip balms I added a little bit of chest into it just to give it a little something I put it back on the pinch me because I kind of like that one a little bit better. Um, I would definitely recommend picking up the brows if you're someone like me who uses a brow gel and likes to have that look. Or if you're someone that's like whose brows lay down and you want to have more of that um, laminated look. Um, I thank you guys for watching. Everyone please stay safe, stay well. Remember to subscribe, like, and share, and you guys have a good one. Bye-bye. See you next time.